And welcome everyone to a WCC chat. I'm Andy Katz. Please be joined by Jim Below from USF. 16 and 14 in your last game. A win on the road at Santa Clara. Uh, Jimbo, what has been clicking so well for you and this squad for the most part this season? Um, for me personally, it's just uh, all the guys, they're, they're really trusting me. And same with the coaches, they're really like kind of, they're, they're believing in me and what I can do. Uh, for the season and, and the guys, it's just we're just one of the closest teams I've played off. We're all really good friends. We hang out, we like each other, we like to have them over at, at my house. And, We'll do like Super Bowl stuff or like have games and different things like that. Now this is a league where obviously there are some bigs, you know, that uh, certainly can compete with you, including your next opponent, the Zags, which clearly uh, they've got uh, as great a front line offensively probably as in the country. Uh, when you go against a front line like that, what do you need to accomplish? Uh, Stay out of That was that's what I had last time. Uh, was, I, when I'm on the floor, I can't help, you know? So it's like, I gotta, I gotta be on the floor so I can help out my team and do whatever I can to help them. Uh, it's harder for me to contribute when I'm sitting on the bench. Uh, but it's just, it's just going and attacking the game, attacking each game uh, with the same mindset of like just intensity and, and doing whatever the team needs you to win. So look, you were familiar with Todd Golden because he was just one seat over from Kyle Smith. Uh, what's been the biggest change? Um, probably just that Coach Smith is gone. That's it. Uh, uh, the biggest change, it's, it hasn't, hasn't changed much. It's, it's very similar. Um, uh, um, they both have uh, similar philosophies, very numbers driven. Uh, run very much the same offense with uh, Huffy as like kind of the offensive coordinator kind of guy. And, really taking the reins on defense and, and different things like that. So it's it's uh it's been it's it's been a very easy transition. Let's say. All right. So I just said you had a double double against Santa Clara, but which number means more to you, the 16 or the 14? 14. Uh, the rebounds. I, I'm always trying to get more rebounds. I, I, it's pretty funny. My dad sits in the stands and he he, he doesn't sit. Uh, I usually have. My family comes to almost every day, and my parents sit on opposite uh, sides. My dad sits uh, and he counts my, my rebounds every game, and he'll like, I'll look, I maybe like look up to him, and he's like giving me numbers. Like, how many, how many more do I need for ten? And so it's, it's. I know he was really happy with me get over ten rebounds. Well, it's great that you got your support. The fact that we can actually see you play all the time. Not everyone has that. That's tremendous. Um, and I know you got a tall task ahead of you coming up against the Zags. Uh, oh, yeah. Stay out of foul trouble. Uh, and I th certainly think we'll get a, a good matchup inside. I appreciate it, Jimbo. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you.